Hi everybody, it's Brooke. I'm gonna show you how to make this creature in Dragon Frame. It's this character I made with fake blood coming out of its mouth. I used Dragon Frame for this and my DSLR. So let's get into it. Here is what the creature looks like. <laughs> this is afterwards. I used clay for this and I used a ring that I had and I put it in his head. And then I used this from a necklace as just something to put in the eye. I've just been finding that like using jewelry in my little clay figures is making it just look that much better. Just like this animation I did of Future. This was all my jewelry. I think it's it just brings life into it. Just find things in your room and that don't even make sense and just like pop them on. Oh, and I also got fake teeth. So I used fake blood, clay, jewelry, and fake teeth from Amazon to make it. Let's get into it. So we're gonna open up Dragon Frame. Just click 24 frames for the frame rate and then set your camera to manual mode for this and switch to camera mode and play with the camera settings. Play with the ISO on your DSLR and the ISO on e the camera settings within Dragon Frame. Then you're gonna open your keypad so you can take photos with the button with the circle. Now we're just setting up for the first shot, taking a photo, moving it a little bit, taking a photo. And then we're gonna mask out this rig that's holding it up for these shots where it's tilting later in Premiere. I'm pouring a little bit of blood in the mouth.
And then at this part where the blood is getting like really intense, I'm literally just pouring it and taking photos really quick to capture the actual like spill out of the nose and mouth. Okay, and there's the finished thing. Now export. Use QuickTime ProRes HQ. Export it somewhere. Okay, now let's put it into Premiere. Alright, we're gonna... Slow it down. I'll slow it down to like 90% speed. Oh, it looks like I did 70 here. Make it a little slower. And then... I've messed up on a frame here. I It accidentally pushed too far down. And then the next one is a little bit um, coming up. So I'm going to switch those places. And now it's makes sense. Okay, now I'm gonna take out the green screen with Ultra Key and play some Blade. <laughs> um, turn the pedestal up. I'm gonna do the contrast. Now we're gonna mask it and keyframe the mask uh, so we can mask the rig out.
added this photo of myself underneath. This is for like a DJ mix I did. And then I could take some fake blood for that splatter at the end. Just anything on YouTube, rip it and then convert it. And that's it. Here's the final product. Thank you for watching and hit like or subscribe, please.